So I'm just going to open up the bread that I hollowed out. And now I'm just going to pour the egg in left to right. Wow. All right. This is about eight eggs. You don't want to fill it all the way to the top because you don't want it to overflow. Yep. Eight eggs right? are just enough. So now we're going to take some bacon bits. Yep. And we're just going to sprinkle that on top. You can use sausage. You can use chorizo, whatever type of meat, ham. Finish emptying this, right? Can you actually pass me that garlic butter? All the butter? Right here. Here's the garlic butter, right? This is just garlic butter time. And what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to brush this over the lid here. Ooh. So this is going to go back on top. But what I'm doing here is just we're going to keep the bread moist. And now what we're also going to do is we're just going to get the edge here, this little coating. Don't worry yeah. if the brush uh, dips in because we're going to add some in the middle. I'm just going to get this all around the edge. It might splatter a little. Don't worry about that. And now I'm just going to take a spoon, right? Yep. Mix it up a little. And we're just going to drizzle this on the top. Give it a little extra flavor kick. Flavor kit. So now can you hand me the cheese over get here? The cheese. I get that for you. It's optional, but you gotta have some cheese in my opinion. You, even if you want to, you could also use Kraft single cheese. Yeah, I've seen that before, but I've done it too. But in my personal opinion, it's shredded works the best. Mm -hmm. You can even put a little bit up here on the top like this. Yep. Also, you know, we got everything from Walmart. Very easy. Yep. Very, very affordable. Easy, very easy to do at home. And you feast the whole family. Set. We're just gonna flip this on top like this. And now this is gonna act as a lid and, and hold all that heat and steam in, right? Yep. And now what we're gonna do, last but not least, we're gonna take this and we're gonna brush the top. The top? It, right? Yes. Keep it nice and moist. This is that last kick that's gonna make yep. it look amazing. When I cut it open at the end, you guys are gonna be so impressed. It's insanely mind blowing. Right, so now we're gonna take this to the oven. So I have the oven on 350. Yep. And we're just gonna put this in like this. Just keep checking on it. Well, look at and that. And watch at the end how good this is. Now, let me this see. This is so ready. Let me look see. Let me this. see. Oh my, oh gosh. my gosh. That looks amazing. Bring it to the dinner table. Bring it to the dinner table. Oh my god. Okay, so let me just put this down and I'm gonna trip towards you. Yep. All right. And when I cut this open, it's going to be insane. Look I just want to take that. a peek at the top first. Oh my gosh. gosh. Let's cut this up. I can't. You got to cut it. You got to cut it, dude. I'm going to hold this because it's a little bit hot. But what I'd like to do is I cut down the middle. Look at that crunch. You hear that? And I like to do slices. So I serve my guests one slice each of this. So here's one. And then I'm going to cut a second slice down the middle Let like me that. see, dude. Oh, my this God. This is like this the ultimate. This is going to be insane. This is the best breakfast sandwich ever. Look at this other piece. Look at that. That is 